Listen. Hi. <laughs> Listen to me. If you have not watched JLo's Makeup Artist Does My Makeup with Scott Barnes, I need you to just click out of my video. Like, who gives a f about me, okay? I need you to go watch the legend do Tati's makeup, okay? I don't wear this much makeup by any means. And by, this is not the makeup, by the way. Okay, I'm taking this off. This is my normal makeup. This is the makeup that me as a peasant, this is what I wear, okay? I am going to try to recreate what Scott Barnes did to Tati. I have been a Jennifer Lopez fan like m for as long as I can remember. I've always been obsessed with her. I'm gonna um, put the link in the description. I'll need to go watch that. If you haven't uh, subscribed to my channel yet, please subscribe. I promise that not all of my videos are me like wanting to cry over how much I love Jennifer Lopez. But lots of them are, so I'm gonna try to go quickly. I just want to see if I can do it. You know, I want to see if I can make myself look like that. I always start with the dark. We're starting with contouring. It's not about contouring on top of makeup. Sometimes it is, but not usually. So I'm gonna treat you as though we were doing like a video shoot. I'm gonna go in ham. Like yes. Makeup. Okay, like we're going in ham. Time. You don't use primer. For what? I don't foundation, so you don't see it. Now, Literally like yes, white so like, where do I ish concealer. So white. Question, right? Really so light. light. Sometimes you see really bad nose contour and it looks like they're behind bars. Okay, couple brushes. Yeah, it does. Okay. So, I'm going to use all nighter. Oh my god, on camera. Is this too light? I feel like I did it too light. So, I bring the light right all the way up to the edge. Sometimes you see I feel like I may have gone too light cuz I feel like this is the color that he used on Tati, but this is too light for me and I think I may have put too much after seeing how much he did. Please we're restarting, we're restarting. I'm trying to copy, I'm trying to be Jennifer Lopez. We're all just trying to be thing. We're all trying to be something we're not. <laughs> Eight down the nose. About Jennifer, Jennifer calls it. Okay. Cat paw. It's literally, it does look like a cat paw, like, eh. So, um, I don't have any Scott Barnes brushes, but after this video, I'm about to buy some. But for now, your girl is using a Wet n Wild brush. This is Wet n Wild, but yeah. So he just blends it in. So anyway, um, what I like to do with it is just kind of blend it out. And just working into the skin. Now I... Turn the nose. I blend it up this way. See? And I got really great new lashes. The house. So, this is what I call. I'm going to do this. Oh, you named this look? Yeah, it's called Snatural. 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 It's <gasps> snatched, but natural. I love that it's, so much. It's kind of oh like glowy and hoey. Yes. <laughs> Where's your merch? You need some. <laughs> she's pretty. She looks natural, but a little bit more. So she's natural. Now, if you need to minimize someone's neck, this one. Tip of the nose. Can't breathe. <sighs> Can't breathe. Okay. And then he goes around the mouth. Around the mouth. Wait, what was he doing around the mouth? Mm -hmm. Just taking it down. So you do makeup differently. Per Gotta trust the process. Gotta trust the process. <laughs> Why am I panicking so much today? Calm down. It's supposed to be fun. I need to take it seriously, but it's supposed to be fun. It's crazy to see it like on camera. It looks so different on camera. I'm pretty tan naturally, so I don't need like too much. But let's just blend that all. This is the Too Faced Born This Way foundation in honey and in warm beige. So let's see what happens next. Lighter foundation. I'm gonna take the same color that I used on my chest. Okay, okay, we're gonna just start 
patting this other foundation in, not taking away from the contouring. Like, really, no one else does that. It's you where know, you just do the, the contour under and then you do it's painted. everything. Like I, don't... I love cream. I think that cream works primarily. Okay, I just realized that he didn't blend out the nose yet. Like, I'm feeling kind of. But I got ahead of myself. I added a little bit more onto the nose because he started going in on the cream. He said that he likes cream blush. I'm gonna use the Glossier cream blush, the pillow paint in dust. I look like a baby. I wanna look like a baby. That is the one thing that I've noticed. We want you to look like a baby. I'll show you. Like I love, and the reason why I waited for this is because this is a dry brush. What I'm doing. Okay. Marrying everybody together. Marry everybody together. I'm using a Jeffree Star brush. Okay, so he blended in the nose at one point. Powder. It looks like he's using like a pretty white powder. Okay, and a little taper brush. So what powder are you using? You're using your powder. I'm using petal. She's a little translucent with a tiny tinge of pink in her. Okay, that's what I'm doing. I'm using a, a translucent one with the pink in it. Highlight. I use a, a lot for highlighters. Love that. Together. Okay. I'm watching this and I'm like, um, like, did a really, really intense, like, detailed nose contour. I don't have that palette that he has, but I'm using the Chrissy Teigen, um, this more peachy color, because it looks like there's a peachy color in there. The Laura Geller Gilded Honey, and then the Global Glow from MAC. I'm just like mixing them all together. It's like this Neutrogena um, spray. He like knows that it's like a secret because it's the JLo Glow. The exact one. Watch, you ready? Okay. Oh, oh. Ah! It's cold. Oh my god. It's beveled so that you can oh. work with He's already on the bronzer. Beveled yes. underneath, yes. and he said, Toast the edges. Okay, it's natural, toast the edges. This looks really good, honestly. This looks really good on camera. Around top, not overlining because we did that. Um, that contour does gets like a pretty golden gloss, swiping underneath. Out and to the edge. The eyeshadow palette is beginning. I'm gonna do the Morphe Bronze Gold palette because you know, Jennifer Lopez, golden goddess. And uh, I also don't have the palette that he has and he doesn't show it because he hasn't come out with it yet. So, yeah. I'm using Senna Brow Powder actually. Okay, so I did a little bit of a reddish golden kind of color. I feel like my brows are looking a lot darker than hers are, but he he said that he didn't want the brows to be overpowering, so I'm just trying not to touch them too much. I'm so excited! I'm using my crease brush on your Oh. I love that crease brush. It is pure magic. It looks kind of like a reddish brown. Reddish brown. Okay. Rounded. Tina and I have very different eye shapes, so I'm doing my best. But I feel like it's the same concept for everyone. Kind of blending that out with a clean brush. And then he takes a reddish gold color. It's fun to play with color. And this is the kind of color that is not offensive. Took like a bronzy reddish uh, terracotta-ish kind of color. And those are these two colors right here, this color and this color. It looks like he's like smudging an eyeliner, but he's not talking about it. So let me just do that really quick. He's doing mascara and lashes. So I'm gonna do that off camera because I don't have his mascara and I don't have his lashes, so, but they both look great. So if you uh, check out the video, you'll see, you'll see that. 
Okay, so lashes are on. I use the faux mink lashes by Ardell. You know, we all try our best. We try our best in, on these streets, you know? It's like blending things out. Wow, that's it. Okay, I'm done. I, I, the, the final result, I mean, obviously I need practice like doing my makeup in this way. I'm like looking at myself so much because I feel like I, I look really good like in the camera. Torlux, I feel like my jaw looks really good. I feel like my lips look really good and like really golden and wow. I'm gonna do beauty shots, ready? And <laughs> Okay, so that looks like everything. It looks like I have finished the tutorial. I tried my best to copy everything that he did. I obviously didn't have a lot of the products that he uses, but I think I'm definitely gonna go online and order some of his brushes. Let me know if you like this video and please go watch the, the original video if you haven't already. It's honestly so informative and it's such a cool way to look at makeup. Everybody does makeup so different and he's like a legend and he really knows what he's doing. Hundreds of covers, hundreds of red carpets and he did JLo's show in Vegas. Like he really knows what he's doing. So you guys all have a great day. Um, please feel free to subscribe down below, you know. Have a good one. <laughs> Bye.